Hey Leo, so I'm gonna do a reading for you guys. We are gonna see what your messages are at this time. Just keep in mind, it is a general reading. Do not force this message to fit your situation, okay? Thank you guys for your love and your support on the channel. I really do appreciate you all. We're gonna go ahead and get started. And we're gonna see what your messages are, okay? Okay, so flexible is here. All right, this is number 19. I'm gonna do one more. What else do you have for the collective Holy Spirit? What else do you have for the collective? And I have one more for the collective. Thank you. And then we have higher power. This is number four. One, nine, four. At the bottom is unfinished symphony, number 10. Okay, I wanna pull these numbers from this deck. So I wanna get 19, four, and 10. All right, so flexible, higher power, unfinished symphony. Okay, so there is an intervention. That's what I'm getting here, intervention. I feel like Spirit is saying, wait, hold on. Before you say no or before you say yes, whatever your response is, um, you need to hear something, okay? <laughs> I want you to hear something. Like I wanna give you some more information, all right? I feel like Spirit has been... Okay, Spirit has been telling you about something new. There is a promise here, all right? This new beginning, this new start. And whatever this is, I feel like Spirit has been letting you know like something new is about to happen. Rainbow again, number four. All right, I'm just matching these, these numbers up. So yeah, rainbow is definitely confirmation for somebody. But um, this could have to do with your family, a relationship, okay? I feel like spirit, I feel like spirit wants to show you something. Okay, let me just, okay, let me just keep going. 19 and 10. I don't know if I passed it. 19. There's 10. Unfinished Symphony Storm Warning. All right, so wait. That's what I'm picking up on. Wait, there's some more information that comes in before you make your <laughs> before you make your final decision. Okay, I don't know. Let's see. 19. Where's 19 at? Okay, I think I passed it. I feel like something does not look the way that you want it to look, or something is not really going the way that you want it to go. And I feel like spirit is asking you to be flexible with this thing that's coming in, okay? I don't know what this is for you. It kind of feels like you have been, um, you have been patient, you have been flexible with the situation, okay? Where's 19 at? Yeah, rest and rejuvenation, number 19. Okay, so this is going to be, you know, a general reading. Just take this how this, you know, fits in your life. But there is something here that Spirit has been, you know, showing you, um, promising you, or this is something that you, you've been asking for. It kind of feels like you know that you're going to have this, okay? It's like a sure sure thing it feels like a sure thing but it's not here yet or it's not happening the way that you're expecting it to happen i feel like spirit wants you to keep being patient or let it go i don't know what that means i see march here yeah hammock is here taking a vacation Physically or mentally, I feel like spirit needs you to rest on this. Some of you may be jumping to conclusions. But I feel like there's more information that's coming in. Yeah, look at this. So bird flying. Spirit is here. It says news is on the way. Okay, so before you make your decision, I feel like before you throw it out or before you just like wash your hands of whatever this is, get, get prepared for more information. So that you can make the the best decision possible okay i feel like there's something else that's missing so there's some more information that's missing spirit can you tell me more about this message for the collective so october 
and then we have horseshoe it says good luck okay october and good luck so the month of october could be significant for you and we have good luck here whoa okay we have older woman this could be you or you could be dealing with an older woman And then I see Jug. It says, a lighthearted, carefree time. At the bottom, I see Tortoise. Slowly but surely getting ahead. I also see the, the eye. I was going to say evil eye. <laughs> Some of you, um, you need to protect your energy. There could be, you know, jealousy around you at this time. It says, psychic ability, trust your intuition. Love is here. I see career. All right. Some of you, um, there's a big ending that's happening at this time. Okay, there's something that is, something being tossed out or something that needs to be finalized. Queen of Rods, Temperance here. You could be a Sagittarius. But something is coming to an end. It's a burden here. Ten of Wands here. This is an old... Thing that you've been holding on to and, and spirit wants you to release that spirit tell me more about this this message I'm also seeing for some of you meditation spending time alone with spirit that's going to be very beneficial alright spending time by yourself so that spirit can speak to you individually. That's going to be beneficial. Spirit, tell me more about this message for the collective. Thank you. Yeah, the Ace of Rods is here. This is that new thing. There's some type of new energy coming into your life. This could be around your love life. This could be around, you know, family. Um, this could be anything for you. But I feel like, um, yeah, you're definitely going through a transition at this time. Things may be a little bit rocky. All right. Things may be a little bit rocky. The spirit is saying, you know, be cool, be calm. Everything really is coming together. It may not look like it, but it is. Yeah, I see the Ten of Swords here. This is that ending Ten of Swords. And then I see the Page of Cups. There is somebody... For some of you, there's somebody that wants to reach out to you. This could be an apology or just a, you know, like, hey, how you doing? <laughs> and I feel like you're not. <laughs> right as I said that, I just kind of feel like <laughs> somebody's already thinking the worst of this person or the situation. And I understand because you've been through a lot. I see that here. But I, I don't know who this is, but. You may be so, I feel like you're you're too quick to, um, like, get rid of them or, like, shut it down, all right? And I feel like spirit is trying to do something for you, but it doesn't look like it. <laughs> That's what it feels like. Yeah, the high priestess is here. Listen to your instincts. Like, really take some time to sit with yourself and let spirit speak to you, okay? Because I feel like some of you are about to shut somebody down automatically just because you're not in the mood i'm not in the mood don't bother me <laughs> that's what i'm picking up and if you're not you know if you're not in the mood then you're just not in the mood but i feel like there is something here that you've been asking spirit for we have happy family here all right this could have to do with you know your family this could benefit not just you but you know if you have children your children spirit tell me more about this message for the collective tell me about this page of cups let's see what this is Tell me about the Page of Cups. I'm also seeing for some of you, yeah, you're very intuitive. You're a psychic, okay? Some of you, you have a strong insight, okay? Strong intuition, okay? The I card, it says psychic ability. Trust your intuition, okay? Trust your instincts. Trust your intuition. That's what spirit needs you to do right now. Trust the messages that you've been given by spirit. Okay? I feel like spirit has already, you know, showed you the outcome of the situation. 
okay this is higher power i feel like you and spirit are like this you guys are you know one <laughs> okay so you can listen to your instinct you can trust your intuition this person or this message that's coming your way this is good energy this is good vibes but i kind of feel like because of you know maybe some things happening in your life in the past present however that's happening you're just kind of like not in the mood but that's an ending 10 10 10 unfinished symphony storm warning spirit tell me about unfinished symphony some so for some of you this ending is currently happening it's not fully over but it's you know slowly taking place all right slowly but surely you are getting ahead spirit tell me about this ending let's see the ten of swords on the spirit tell me about that the ten of swords yeah, the Nine of Swords. Yeah, look at that. We have the King of Pentacles here at the bottom. This has been a very frustrating situation or cycle that you've been dealing with mentally for some of you. All right, this thing that Spirit has been showing you, it's, it has been a long road or a long journey. You've been through a lot. And you may be frustrated and some of you may be in this energy of just over it you know like this could be about your love life maybe spirit has shown you you're gonna get married and you're still not married you're single and it just doesn't look like that and so you're kind of in this like you know chip on your shoulder type of energy you know so it's like it, what you're asking for it's being presented to you now I feel like spirit really needs you to listen to your intuition okay some of you are connecting to people and you may not <laughs> you may not be in the mood because of what you've been through so if you want love or if you want to connect if you want you know real friendships if you want you know to enjoy that feeling it's here i'm seeing that it's here but you're not really seeing it spirit tell me more about this message for the collective what else do you have for the collective so this is like some old energy, old residue, old mindsets, old thoughts that are resurfacing. And spirit wants you to look at that and ask yourself, does this serve you? Is this helping you? Is this, you know, a benefit? Is this doing anything for you? And if not, then that needs to be released. Three of Pentacles here. And then we see the Knight of Pentacles. you working on yourself i see you trying i see you really um you know it's not an easy process it's been a slow moving process for some of you but you are moving some of you you don't really feel like you're getting ahead you feel like you know some of you may feel like you're tired of this you know this feeling like i'm tired of healing type of energy is here like i'm tired of this process it's so it's long it's, and I don't see any growth. I still don't see. I still don't see it, Spirit. That's what I'm seeing. Tell me more about that, Spirit. I feel like you have been um, very particular with who you have in your life or what you, who you spend your time with. Okay. Some of you have been single for a long time. Some of you have not really had any type of friendships. There hasn't been that energy of like lighthearted, carefree time because you've been working on yourself. I'm seeing that. Okay, so with other people, it hasn't been that lighthearted, carefree time because you've been working on yourself. Spirit, tell me more about that. Yeah, but that's about to change. We have the Eight of Wands here. Eight of Wands. So there's new energy that's coming in. And it's energy that you have, you've manifested this. You put this out. Some of those thoughts, those intentions that you've been putting out, it feels like they're they're playing out right now. It kind of feels like you're going from not having any options to having all the options. <laughs> 
I see the five of cups, but then it's also like, I don't know, because of what I've been through in my past. Like, what if I choose the wrong one? What if I don't do it right? What if, you know, this is a fake friend or whatever this is that you're, you know, you're choosing. We have the moon card. Listen to your instincts. Go with your heart. Go with what feels right. All right. It may, sometimes it's it's not easy to look at a person and see, you know. Oh, yeah, that's a good person. Like, what does your heart say about this person? Or what does your heart say about this situation? What do you feel about that? I feel like that's what spirit wants you to use, okay? Especially if you're kind of feeling like, you know, I guess frustrated or just over the situation. Hmm. This is old energy that's coming up, though. Spirit, what other... Okay. Um, what else do you have? What other messages? What other messages do you have for the collective about this... This reading? What else do you have, Spirit? Yeah, Two of Swords. Okay. Two of Swords is here. Some of you are in this energy of kind of just wanting to be by yourself. Okay? So listen to your intuition still trying to process some things yeah but we have the world's card here and we have the eight of cups okay the four of swords hmm. this is a big thing that you've been going through a big cycle yeah the moon and the star a big cycle you've been going through um yeah on the inside is what i want to say on the internally there's been like an internal battle struggle that you've been going through I feel like some of you, there are some thoughts that are coming up at this time that don't really make sense, you know, especially with some of the conversations and, you know, just the sit down moments you've been having with spirit about your life. Some of these old thoughts that are coming up, they don't really make sense. Okay. And, it's, and it feels like it's coming up so that you can let that go so that, so that you can really accept um, the things that you deserve. All right, so again, like spending time with spirit, alone time with spirit, that's going to be very beneficial for you, okay? Clear your head, clear your mind, okay? Go on a walk. It just kind of feels like the old version or the old thoughts that you used to think are coming up so that you can let that go. That's what that feels like. Spirit, tell me more about this, this reading. I just want to do like a few from this deck and then I'm going to wrap this up. Spirit, tell me more. Friendship is here. It says, a friend needs your help. Your kindness and excellent counseling skills will put them back on track, okay? We have luck. A sudden change of luck is likely. Things are working in your favor. Excellent time for networking, okay? And then we have this good luck. Things are really working in your favor. And it may not seem like it right now. And it just feels like clutter, mental clutter is coming up so that you can, like, sweep it away, all right? So, again, like, the conversations that you're having with spirit about your life and about where you want your life to go and the answers and the responses that you're getting from spirit, pay attention to that, okay? Listen to your intuition, all right? Can I have one more? One more spirit for the collective. Thank you. And we have positive work outcomes. It says consistent efforts will bring rewards and a major purchase is worth making, okay? You guys really are on the right track, okay? It may not feel like it or seem like it at this time. Spirit needs you to refocus, okay? I'm going to leave this reading here. I hope it was helpful. I will talk to you guys soon, okay? Bye.